Hi, my name is George Colasar, and I'm actually one of the elders here at Harvest Church. So my story is about my mom, and it's a story about salvation. Um, for many years, I've been working on telling my mom the gospel, and her thought of getting to heaven was about how many good works she's done over the course of her life. And as time went along, the conversation would get a little bit more elevated, and it got to the point where I actually didn't really even want to have the conversation with her anymore about salvation because she just didn't want to really talk about it. In fact, her quote to me was, none of that Jesus talk. So I didn't really talk to her much about salvation and the gospel. I just kind of let it alone. So a few months ago, my mom had an accident and um, we found ourselves dealing with her injury and her decline. And at one point in time, I found myself alone with my mom and she kind of responded a little bit to me um, in the state that she was in. And I asked her if she wanted to pray. And uh, my mom said, sure, let's pray. And uh, I started praying and I was praying for many things uh, at that point, uh, salvation and healing. Um, to be honest, I can't even tell you the words that I was saying. And when I got done praying, I said, amen. And my mom, she looked straight at me and uh, she said, amen. And then she said, I told Jesus my name. And at that point, I knew that she had got the message about salvation and the gospel went true. So that's my story. Um, she died two days later. And I know that today from that, that little conversation over many years of time, but that little conversation led her to Christ. And she, she told Jesus her name. And I'm convinced that she accepted Christ as her savior at that point in time. Because when my mom said those words to me, I started crying. Phew, couldn't take it. <clears throat> you know, it's fresh. It's, uh, it's always fresh. You know, when I say that, I tell someone that story, it's like uh, the emotion just wants to come back out because it was amazing. There's nothing you can say different than about that, right? The takeaway that I got from that story with my mom is that we can never give up hope. Um, I didn't ever give up hope on my mom, but I did pray about it. I continually prayed about that for, for my mom to hear the gospel. And I'm convinced that as I was praying, um, the Holy Spirit let her see Jesus. And that made that seed grow. Things may be impossible, may seem very difficult, but I think through Christ, we can accomplish great things. Um, whether it's the things in our lives that we want to do, or if it's about salvation, we, we got to be encouraged by our faith in Christ and who he is and what he's done for us. My encouragement from that story to you is to never give up hope, to never give up. And we have to be courageous when the opportunity to pre presents itself for us to talk about the gospel to someone, we need to do it. And we need to always have faith that Christ is always working in the background to make that happen.